Picture this, a skater effortlessly gliding across a frozen lake, their movements fluid and graceful. But have you ever paused to wonder, why exactly do ice skates glide so smoothly? The answer is hiding right beneath the blade. And trust me, it's not what you think. Some of you might believe, as most of us were taught in school, that the pressure from the skate blade melts the ice, creating a thin layer of water and reducing friction. Makes sense, right? Well, science is here to surprise you, because this explanation doesn't quite hold up under scrutiny. Here's the twist. Ice is naturally slippery, not just because of pressure, but due to a phenomenon occurring on its surface. At any temperature up to around 20 degrees Celsius, the topmost molecules of ice behave like liquid. These molecules don't bind fully, forming a kind of ultra-thin layer of quasi-liquid water. Think of it as nature's lubrication system, already in place. This is what allows the skate blade to glide with minimal resistance. Mind blown? We're just getting started. Now, what happens when you add pressure, like a skater's weight on the blade? Pressure might lower the melting point of ice slightly, adding a bit of liquid water to the mix. But studies show that this effect is not as significant as we once thought. The real VIP here is that semi-liquid layer. It's nature's way of saying, let's have some fun on the ice. Still not convinced? Let's talk about why skating works even in Arctic temperatures, where the pressure-induced melting theory won't hold water, literally. In these cold conditions, the layer of quasi-liquid water becomes thinner, but still exists. That's how you can glide your way through even the chilliest of terrains. And for the skeptics out there wondering about curling? Yep, this same principle applies. The brooms heat up the surface just enough to make that quasi-liquid layer more effective, adding a layer of science to this often overlooked sport. So the next time you watch a skater performing jaw-dropping spins or racing in speed skating events, remember, you're witnessing an elegant dance powered by the mysterious molecular beauty of ice. This is science you can skate on. If you've learned something new about the incredible physics of ice skating, drop a comment below. Let us know, did this change the way you see skating forever? Hit like and share this science story so the world can keep gliding on these revelations. See you in the next episode.